Hi everyone, it's Marsha at Twin Flame Reconnection. I wanted to talk to you about accountability and responsibility on the Ascension Twin Flame journey. Now, I've certainly been there and I know a lot of people have or are still there um, where they have where you have awakened and you're suddenly seeing the world differently and you're interested in more spiritual things and maybe you start to do meditation and yoga and sound baths and um, finding healing courses either to heal yourself or to start doing and you suddenly have all these ideas of how your life should be and um, doing a gratitude journal. Um, maybe you've gone on a few retreats yourself and call it doing the work. Well, I'm here to tell you, um, although it has served for some amount of time you are now here watching this video and probably a lot of Patricia's video videos and um, looking for signs or agreeing with the things that are being said but not actually starting to engage your new twin flame light body now The thing is, um, on this journey, we all have moments that we don't want to do the work. We don't want to do it. We don't want things to change uh, because we know that in order for things to change, it means that we need to engage ourselves and become accountable for both ourselves and our twin flame on this path. And we see it as this huge mountain, maybe full of problems and difficulties, and we just don't want to do it. There's too much. Um, we cannot do it. I'm working. I have sports. I have kids. I have a marriage that is falling apart. Or I'm a single parent like me. Um, my kids are playing up. There's always something not to do. The thing that is the most important. But I can promise you, when you start doing this work, it moves so swiftly and so delicately and it is like your problems are just disappearing like thin air doors start to open again and yes then still you will have you, you will account other problems that you you um you have and you have to deal with that also the way i see it is that we're no longer teenagers whether you are 18 or 50 or anything else we're not teenagers playing in karma anymore so it's time for us to evolve as persons as a species and we need that by using this modality and using the new light body. So basically your new light body is your vehicle that you can customize yourself for the life you want and the needs you want in your life when you are together with your twin flame. Um, I understand 
like no other, not wanting to do the work. And um, I may be strict in that, um, but you cannot complain about your situation and just watching videos and doing a meditation and reading self-help books and then believing it will all go away. I think a lot of people still feel, and I've had this similar a few years back, that I didn't have to do the work. I would move on and I believe that I would ascend into the next levels without doing things, maybe a little breath work here, maybe a little gratitude there and then believing the gates will open and somehow I will get through there or maybe hitch a ride or whatever. Now, I think this is what many of us are remembering of other times that we were on this planet and ascending. And this ascension is very different. It's very different. It is very personal and you will each have to do the work, whether you like it or not. And instead of uh, waiting for the moment that things start falling apart in your life, see this as a sign to have a session, a coaching session or a spirit chat and get you unstuck and get some things moved so you can start engaging your new light body and finding out how magnificent it truly is. So I hope to see you there and for now have a great weekend.